obviously I am Mr. They Can't Deport Us All. Mm. Uh, I am the son of immigrants. Um, I have a soft spot in my heart for immigrants. However, I was never pro MS-13. I was never pro human trafficking and and child, you know, kids being trafficked. And I was never pro fentanyl. I was never Mr. Uh, pro promoting the cartels and shit. Because right now Biden, he's helping the cartels enrich themselves. He's fattening the cartels' pockets and the dope dealers' pockets and the human traffickers' pockets because he has caused this crisis to where the Border Patrol have now become bus drivers. They're just daycare. They're going around. It's, it's, they say it's just thousands and thousands of people not coming through a port of entry. They're right. just they're just exploiting the fact that uh, Biden said, y'all quit building the wall. So you could just see where they left off on the wall. And they put a little stop sign right there. And people just whatever. And they have just rafts. They have a system. The, the, the Coyotes have a system now with wristbands to see who paid, who hasn't paid. Um, they have a strategy where they're taking advantage of the fact that they're overwhelming the Border Patrol. So, like, they know some people are going to get caught, and then they could let in anybody that's coming through from special interest countries, China, Iran, Iraq, et cetera. You know, they'll smuggle them in over here. Uh, one dude got caught with enough fentanyl to kill the whole fucking country. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Um, thanks a lot, uh, Joe Breezy. And <laughs> Jim Psaki won't admit this shit is a crisis. Again, this coming from Chingo Bling, Mr. They Can't Deport Us All. But guess what? The people out there in Star County, in Zapata, Texas, all across the border, Laredo, McAllen, everywhere, they're going to feel this shit firsthand. You know, before these folks start spreading into communities, man, how, much you, how many MS-13 and stuff you think is yeah. coming through there? And now Biden changed the rules to where if a cop calls ICE and says, hey, man, I got this dude, he was breaking into cars or something, and um, he has multiple illegal entries or whatever on his record uh we need y'all to come get him right we gotta call ice ice is like no under new rules that's not a high priority they have to be specifically convicted of like specific things just catch and release right yeah so basically the dude y'all caught breaking into shit go ahead and let him back in that community yeah congratulations we got fucked 